you guys are going to wish for a, a new virus every year because I, I just randomly just start making videos just to give something else to do in my life when I'm at home playing with my kid in the basement. He's cleaning up on the other side of the room, so you might hear him in this video. Anyway, this whole thing with iDubs. Now, I'm not going to try and validate his video at all because I think it was a terrible response video. It just did nothing but make things worse. But, my God, the level of kicking him right now is like... I get that he was the golden child, the guy that was just like like untouchable of content cop material. Like that video he made yesterday was something that would be in a content cop about rice gum, about Jake Paul, about Leafy is here, about anyone he, he's made. I know he didn't make a content cop on Jake Paul, but anyone that he's made a content cop about, if they made a video like iDubs made yesterday or the – two days ago now that would be dissected end to end in a content cop video. Like that's how just cringy, how illogical, how unsensical, nonsensical that video was, how poor the points were, how poorly his message was conveyed. I get all that, but man, people are acting like he he tied your mother's down and had his way with her. Like, are are people really giving up on him because of one very, very, very poorly made response video? Hi, kid. Can you say hello? He waved at the... Okay. He waved and then ran away. Um... I just see all the piling on that's going on right now. And I mean, Keem stars on top of a mountain and like, I mean, my God, Mr. Barely a human being is on top of the mountain holding up a big L and just descending it down upon Ian. Like <laughs> that's how bad that video was yesterday. It makes Keem star stand on top of the mountain top and smile. And to be fair, he can because that was a big L that, that iDubs took two days ago. But that being said, I was just like, this disappoints me because I never expected this level of legit anger out of iDubs. And he was legit angry. And, you know, uh, people may be saying like, well, he's defending the honor of his girl. I mean, when you're uploading your nudie bits to a website you just got to accept being called a simp and her being called an W-H-O-R-E. I don't want little man repeating that word around his mother because Archfiend will get kicked out of his lovely house with his finished basement that is his man cave, as you can see behind you. Anyway, um, yeah, so I've just finished watching that video. I made my little video yesterday and I was like, I was like all right, that's it. I expect that. Uh, iDubs isn't going to turn into Boogie2988 and be the guy that I, oh, I got to make another response. I got to make another response. I, I made a response to this, this level of criticism that's thrown against me, but I got to make another one. And then after that, I got to make another one to the people who responded to that. Like, I, I, I'm, I'm a little bit fearful that iDubs will turn into that, but I'm majority hopeful that he won't. And that he's just going to go back to making the content. And this was a one and done type thing. And we're all going to move on and forget about this whole thing in, in a couple weeks. Because again, and, and I hear all the people out there that are just echoing the points of like, you know, they're just two consenting adults doing two consenting adult things. They're not breaking any laws. And, and that's the thing, like, there's content creators out there that break like legit laws and um, they do just fine. So do we have to be that upset? And again... I think it all just falls back on people just expecting this guy to be the perfect example to never be clowned on to the level that he's getting clowned on for that last video he made. And that video is worthy of getting clowned on. It's worthy of it, people. Again, I'm not going to try and vindicate that video at all. 
But the thing is, is it was made, it was done. When do you move on from it? It's the top of my kid's head in the background now. Um, when do you move on from it? And is this really going to be an echoing cancer on his channel throughout the future? Like, is it going to be that bad? Because I'm starting to think that this could turn into something that is not just a stumbling block for him, but it's something that brings him down a lot more pegs than it should. Buddy, please don't rip things down in the background, please. Pretty please. Can you go get your excavator? No? All right. He's staring at the... Can you say hello? He waved again and then went away. Okay. Can you say hello now? Can you blow kisses? Okay, he's blowing kisses with his hand. Again, I, I ain't Shay Carl. I'm not putting my kid on camera. All you're going to see is the top of his head at most, which is right. Yeah, there you go. That's all you get to see. Anyway, uh, this whole iDubs thing, it's just its just crazy because I'm, uh, I know it's just the day after or the day after the day after now. And like stuff is still going full steam on this guy. And this is why this video was so damaging yesterday in that it opened up a whole world of trolling to him that was unaware and didn't need to be gaslit, but now they're lit and they're a raging ball of fire and iDubbbz brought it on himself for this. Again, that's why I said, why did you make that video? All you did is get more people to hate you and make more people unaware of the situation now aware. I don't know, man. Uh, buddy, don't go up the stairs without an adult supervising you, please. Anyways, let me wrap this video up. The kid wants to go upstairs. Do you want something to eat, bud? Okay. What do you want to eat? He wants a peanut butter sandwich. Okay. So with that being said, everyone stay safe out there. I dubs just my only advice would be is you just you just act like none of this ever happened. Just let people keep throwing attention your way on the periphery. You'll get more people subscribing to your girl's OnlyFans account. She could do her thing. You can do your thing. I'll still be watching your videos and there'll be plenty of people like me that are watching your videos too. So just stay at it. But again, that video, that was just a complete L. L. Anyway, I had it right the first time, right? Okay, anyways. Have a good day, everyone. And no, this is not a return of the Archfiend, even though you've been seeing all these videos. It's just because, again, I'm doing something to break up my days because I've been in my house for 16 days now. I've left three times to go grocery shopping. That's it. Like, that's it. Not counting times I go outside to go running. I mean, physically go something, do something other than running. Anyway, goodbye.